Hey guys, how you going? Um, just thought I'd do a quick review on my um, Hobie, uh, the Hobie Outriggers. Um, before I was trying to buy them, um, I found it hard to find any decent reviews on YouTube and what have you, so I thought I'd throw one on there. Um, I know a lot of guys, whether you need them or not, um, <clears throat> probably think they're irrelevant, especially on the on the OB Outback because it's a very stable boat. But um, I just found when I went offshore, I just you know just wanted a little bit more stability, and also when I um, stand and flick plastics around and uh, when I'm fishing dams and what have you, going for bass, um, I like to stand a lot. So I thought the extra stability would be good. But anyway. Um, here they are, um, you can get them in the two colours, the green and the um, the tan, I went the green, nice and plain, uh, mounted really easy, um, I, I'm not a big fan of the well nuts that Hobie um, supply, so what I did I could only reach, because as you can see I put the square hatch in, um, I could only reach up to the uh, first screw which is um, just this one here. Um, I actually put a large washer and nut and bolt on there. I had to use a well nut on the back one because uh, I did read some reviews that these tended to spin after a while because you can't tighten them properly with the well nuts. So I thought that would overcome that problem. But other than that, um, love them. Took them out for a bit of a um, test run this morning, which I'll throw that video on here as well. Um, and very happy. I have capsized my Outback. Um, <laughs> I was being a bit ridiculous on it, but um, I have done it. But there's nearly no way you'd capsize with these on. Also, too, um, I very rarely will use the Outriggers. Um, I'll only pretty much use them when I'm offshore on a <clears throat> bit of a hairy day. Um, and when I'm standing, so otherwise I'll be tucked away up in the hull. Also, too, if you're interested, um, I do have the Hobie Evolve. Um, I, on my channel, I probably posted it probably up to two years ago. I did show the Evolve on the back of my Hobie Pro Angler, uh, which I'll be selling shortly as I, I love my Outback. Um, but I have run it on this. I, I rudder mount it. I take off the sailing rudder here and I put my... Um, OB Evolve on and it is an absolute screamer um, it's great for just getting out to fishing spots and I fish on the um, pedals and motor on home so it's great so um, just keep in mind that I will be posting a review on that as well um, and as you can see this is where I mount the Evolve remote control and all wirings internal and I come over here and I'll plug it in here. But I'll show another video of that later. And I'll also may throw a video on 
how I've made my cooler. It's also a just has a bubbler in there, so I can use it as a quick live well. But I'll give a better um, run over the um, the way I set up in another video.